Our approach to fixed income management to me is pretty basic. I've been doing it this way forever. I've been in the market for a long time. But all we're trying to do is cast a very broad net across the fixed income markets. Identify undervalued sectors of the market, whether it's certain areas of the corporate market or the mortgage market or even treasuries at certain points in the cycle. Find the undervalued sectors, identify mispriced securities, and when it's time to build out the portfolio, put all those securities into play, don't worry so much where interest rates are going. Do I want to be really long or really short duration or interest rate risk? We always stay fairly neutral there. But understand where we are in the monetary policy cycle, where we are in the economic cycle, and build out your maturity structure for where you anticipate the shape of the yield curve will be 12 months forward. Will it get steeper? Will it flatten? Might it invert if the Fed really wants to turn down the economy and prevent some areas of serious overvaluation? How you structure the maturity range as you build out your sector allocations yields a lot more value. It is slow, steady, incremental return. It's consistently repeatable, and it's a lower volatility outcome than trying to anticipate where interest rates are going. We sleep better at night doing that. We hope our clients sleep better at night doing that.